Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for 29th, 30th, 31st, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for my Cancers. Hello, my Cancers. How are you? Well, you know, weekend reading, two Radley Valentine decks. I'm using my Angel Tarot cards for the main message. And then I try to pull one from my Archangel Powered Tarot cards. I've prayed, meditated, and infused both decks with Reiki energy, but remember... This is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like. Leave the rest. Okay. Some cards are already popping for you. So we're going to... These three came out on the top. Anyway. Um, over the weekend, you know that I'm a Reiki 3 practitioner. and But over the weekend, I retook for a refresher Reiki 1 and 2. I have to tell you, it was wonderful. It helped to recharge, which is really, really great. And, you know... Uh, Awesome, awesome uh, teacher. He did my Reiki 3 for me, and now he, you know, 1 and 2. But that's Jeff Crawford out of Nashville. Shout out to Jeff. And, you know, he does do distant, distant um, classes, distant learning. So shout out to Jeff Crawford. Anyway, I am an intuitive channeler. And what that means is I open myself up to my higher power for whatever the message is that needs to come through for whoever needs to hear it. Anyway, and I am pretty pretty charged up after this weekend. Anyway, I have three cards face down. The last card is reversed, and that's strong energy. And come on now, Cancers, it's time to keep get this ball on the keep this ball rolling. Get the show on the road. You know I never do good with those, with the sayings. But anyway, let's see for the weekend for my Cancers. First card up is the three of fire fire energy is our leo it's our sagittarius it's our aries energy fire passionate burning determined energy there's a three something with the threes is kind of jumping out so we'll see if we have any other threes here too but this is about you know abundance this is about re reclaiming receiving this is about you know again you know i think this is continues along your energy cycle you know things don't well, they do. They do. You know, I always say expect a miracle and miracles will come. Um, so, but this is, things are about to, ch this, things are changing. I'm not going to say about to. They have been changing. They have been cycling. They have been moving towards this. And this is, I'm feeling like this is fruit, um, um, you know, um, seeing the fruits, seeing the fruits of your labor. This is receiving the the harvest. This is, you know, it's the things that you've been doing. So could this be then on Friday that it's like things start to really gel together? It could be because, you know, I'm always, you, you get really strong messages over for the weekend. So it could be that it's coming now as you view this too. Okay. But it is. Keep it, pos keep it positive. Keep putting it out there. And again, I've told you this too, because my cancers, you are really affected by that moon. You know, the new moon to the full moon. Request, request, request. Abundance. Things looking very good. Have patience at this time. Make long-term plans. Yes, it's time. It's time. Okay. Now, next card up is the king of water. Water energy is your energy. It's also Scorpio and Pisces energy, emotional fluid. And this is, you. I'm feeling like you really coming into your own, really kind of, you know, you know, that your emotional balance is returning to you. Something you haven't seen for a while to this degree, to this degree, okay? And, you know, I'm feeling optimism. I'm feeling hope again. I'm feeling like you're seeing things actually open up for you more and more. Now, this is trustworthy, compassionate, respected, cultured. Open your heart and mind to those around you. Trustworthy and heartfelt advice, charity work. I do feel that there's somebody coming in to give you some good news, um, you know, about whatever this is. Okay. Now, last card. This one's reversed, my cancers. Here we go. The sun. Good news. This is, you know, Archangel Energy card, a Major Arcana card, the sun, good news, you know, good resolution, things, you know, the sun comes out, you know, you know, I know I shouldn't try the uh, those little sayings because I, I do mix them up a little, a lot. Anyway, but the sun comes out, things are shining on you now, things are opening up for you now. This is about you claiming it, claiming your power. Too many times, and we've talked about this, my cancers, too many times you 
you know, you did not realize how strong you were, okay? Let's put it that way. You didn't realize how strong you are. This weekend, game changer on that. Game changer on that. Happy outcome, brilliant new ideas that lead to success. Have confidence in yourself. Your strength, you have been tempered through the fire. You have gone through, you have gone through the fire, my cancers. And, you know, I mean, I mean, and this is through, you know, your loved ones. You know, you have held on to so much of their stuff, uh, but you have been tempered. You have been you know, you have been brought to a higher level. Your strength is now amazing. And your last card, it just popped out. This one's face up. It is the page of Michael. Michael energy is our air energy. It is our Gemini. We're in Gemini season. We're also, this is also Libra and Aquarius thought processes, intellect, hearing news, okay? And this is about you hearing news about something changing. So a lot of this, you know, the abundance coming in, an old debt being paid, you know, you, you feeling stronger in who you are, you realizing that, you know, it really doesn't matter what they say. It matters what you know about you. And my gosh, my cancers, you have been, again, tempered. You have gone through the fire, and now's the time for you to come out as the strong Cancerian you are. Again, remember, Gemini season is wrapping up your astrological year. So it's getting things ready so that you can really do, you know, I'm, I'm here, okay, bust a move. You're going to bust a move. That song, you know, so, okay. I'm not going to sing it, you're, but it's time, you know, but you're getting ready to bust a move when Cancer season starts. Anyway, Page of Michael, truthful, perceptive, analytical, blunt. An exciting new challenge. You have what it takes to succeed. Review contracts or documents very thoroughly. This is one thing, though. Before you sign, my cancers, I'm really, you know, I get this anyway when I see this, but I really feel that this could be something for many of my cancers. If you're signing on, you know, and again, something with travel, be careful with what you're signing about travel. Now, if you're getting you know, if you are, if you're signing up for um, like a trip or something, make sure you get the, I, I, I'm feeling like you should, you, you do what you feel is right, but I'm feeling like you should get the travel insurance. Um, if you're signing up for, and again, there's something with traveling, moving, uh, maybe this is a new house, a new apartment, new, make sure you really look at the contract, okay? Look at the contract, maybe have somebody else look at it too, but there is something that contracts, um, contract signatures, things like that. Just, just be smart. Be really aware, aware of it. Okay. Just be really aware. Have someone else look it over that you could trust also. Okay. Whoever needed that one. Anyway, my cancers, we are so close to 20,000 subscribers. Thank you. You know, I love you so much. Thank you so much. Anyway, if you haven't done the stuff down there, remember the thumbs up, subscribe, share, do all of that, okay? And as always, my Cancers, know that you are loved, stay safe, and be blessed. Bye-bye.